Hey guys, welcome to this episode of the Red Dead Redemption 2 playthrough. This is episode, I believe, 12 now? Yeah. So, in this episode, um, I'm over here at the Emerald Ranch. I visited the fence. Excuse me. I'm starting my nose itches. But I visited the fence. Uh, I sold off some of the like jewelry I'd picked up uh, while doing you know, looting and stuff. But uh, we're going to head back to the camp because we have a side mission that just appeared. So uh, we're going to head back to the camp and uh, see what the side mission is all about. It's with Javier. It says home robbery. So I'm not quite sure what it is, but it could be interesting. So we're going to head back see what we got going on. Very beautiful sunrise we have going on uh, here. Um, and then uh, finishing off last episode, uh, we tried to get Arthur blackout drunk. Didn't really work. Um, and uh, so I don't think we are meant to black uh, get Arthur blackout drunk. Um, but I did realize that uh, I could sing around the campfire. Um, so I didn't realize that at the time. But after the video was over, I realized. But yeah, uh, I just thought it was a neat little thing to interact with. Um, I did a couple upgrades to the camp. Um, all I did was buy like a chicken coop, upgraded Arthur's tent so I can fast travel, um, resupplied all the tents, or not tents, but ammo, food, and med cart. Um, and then, um, what else did I do? I upgraded all the tents. So everybody in the camp has, now has upgraded tents. So the next thing I think I'll purchase will be the uh, horse stable. Or the horse like corral thing it's $240 which I have but it'll put me like down to $100 and I don't want to put myself in that point because in case I need to buy ammo or something or need to do something buy some kind of upgrade um, which I'm sure we'll probably be making hopefully a lot more money soon um, I've been spending most of the stuff I've been make like finding gold bar money and stuff um, just because I want to get like as many upgrades as I can off the bat at least to the camp and uh, I know I need to upgrade like Arthur's satchel and stuff um, I need to do that by getting like uh, Good pelts, so I may do that off camera. Um, I don't know if you guys want to see me like go hunting um, For those pelts because it's kind of really time-consuming and can be boring um, But yeah, all right, so we're back here at camp Let's see what Javier's got for us. Man, Pal is all bloody. Let me clean him, clean him off. Who's that? Man's coming in. Good to see you back in one piece. Uh. Once an old Driscoll, always That's an old Driscoll. Boy. What's your problem? I already proved myself. All right. Back at camp. Let's go see what Javier's got going on. Alright, let's try to avoid... Probably do the letter, and then... I want to save Dutch for last, because I feel like Dutch is going to make a huge jump in the story um, with this next mission. So... What am I sitting on? Am I sitting on anything? No, there's nothing there. What the crap? Alright, so I guess we can't meet with Javier yet. What is this? Is this the Reverend's Bible? Maybe? Open. Uh, interesting. I wonder who is oh is this is this a cigar or an apple wait what are we taking oh it's an apple hey Arthur Javier oh interesting any new leads I'm working on it hey Javier I heard about a house. It could be interesting. What kind of a house? I don't know. A couple fellas I heard in town, they said 
Said it was really freakish. A family local boogeyman, I guess. Just... But they're crooked in every way. So? Well, so these boys thought they were sitting on a lot of cash. And they're highway robbers, kidnappers, apparently. But they're well hidden in the woods. This sounds pretty dubious. Of course. Yeah, yeah, it's dubious, but there ain't much risk of getting caught. Okay, then. Let's go take a look. Exactly. Just take a look. Hmm. This could be interesting. It's up north, on the other side of the river from Valentine. Best way there is through Cumberland Falls, though. You know it? Sure, more or less. More or less. All right, Impala. You ready to go? It's a little dark right now. Okay, there we go. Cutscene. Riding on on a horse, riding on in parallel. Don't know what to do, but riding on a parallel. <laughs> All right. Pretty close now. Just let's stop and go on foot from here. Will be some freakish, freakish thing. I bet. So witches. There's a spot up ahead where we should be able to get a good look at the place. I want to make sure we don't run into any surprises. Right, sounds sure. good. Apparently, this family's been isolated for so long they started talking in their own weird dialect. Interesting. They really don't like outsiders, especially on their turf. <sighs> well, you just keep selling me on this job, don't you? <laughs> Yeah, Javier, sounds an awful, awful sketch. Yeah, here we go. Oh, big place, right? Well, there's a pretty big barn in the back. Not a bad place yeah, to start horse. looking. There must be a lot of people living here. It's a large house. Stairs could be in any one of them buildings, and who knows how many people are in there. I ain't sure about this. I, I think we need to draw them out somehow. And hmm. I got an idea. Follow All right. Me. This could be interesting. Javier, I feel like he's got some tricks up his sleeve. Dynamite. That's the that's the key. Just level everything. Then what we have to do is just sort through the rubber, rubber, rubble. Look at the place. Well, hopefully it'll make it harder for them to spot us, too. Coast seems clear so far. Yeah, so far. <laughs> They're very skeptical. I would be, too, though. They are living a dangerous lifestyle. An outlaw lifestyle. Hey, keep it down. I hear voices. Right, let's get out of dress to you. Ooh. Behind this shed, see if we can hear what they're saying. Just stay quiet. Maybe you cut the tip this time once, pal. Where you been now, Nook? Don't be boiling now, Pappy. I gone for ten minutes, I was. Out of gag all day now, day long. Cause Edie takes patrol now, don't you? What? Yo, Edie, get all the jam. You shut your gulper, or I'll flag her your belt, I will. You leave some pull it out for one. Huh? Go guard the shed. Go! You understand what they're saying? Not much of it. What we doing? Rock over there. I'll create a little distraction, and then you jump them, okay? What kind of distraction? You'll see. All right, here we go. We'll sneak up on them.
What the hickory happened here? We got to put this out, don't you? Oh. Right up the butt. Ouch, ouch. Arthur, aim. Horses are freaking out. Has to be under here. There's no place Hold else on. I could store it. I'll loot all the bodies. Hey, Arthur. Give me a hand here. All right, all right. Let's get it over here. Push this box. Push. Put your back into it, boy. Trouble, didn't I? Yeah. Let's go, Javier. You take this. Let's split up. I'll meet you back at camp. Right, sounds good. Guy gone. That's a lot of money. Yeah. <coughs> For a second, I thought Javier was about to get shot. That lady's up there. Where's the other dead bodies. I'm gonna search all the bodies. I'll loot all the bodies. Wonder, should we take these horses? Would it be worth it? I don't know. Search this house. Gotta study the horses. American paint. Okay, they calm down. Premium cigarettes. Premium cigarette. Right, looks like I need to. I think Arthur's inventory is full. With premium cigarettes, so we need to I think smoke some premium cigarettes. Where are they at? I forget. No, it won't be there. Be no, not there. Maybe here. Where are those premium cigarettes? I was just like, ah, there, there. All right, just smoke a couple of premium cigarettes that way we can pick up these extra packs. 
There you go. All right. Smoke some more premium cigarettes. Come on, Arthur. Smoke them up. There we go. All right, let's search the rest of this place real quick. Search wardrobe. Hopefully we can get some good stuff. More money, maybe. We got gun oil. No, don't want that. Possibly anything here. Barrel that goes outside. Oh wait, here we go. Ooh, what we got in this? Uh, nothing we can take, unfortunately. Anything over here? Uh, nope. All right, we got some cabinets. We'll search cabinets. Sorry guys, I know this is kind of the grindy part of it, um, but yeah. But you gotta, you gotta, you gotta do the looting, man. You gotta get the money. You gotta make the money, 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 money. I need to like, I don't know. Maybe I'll figure out a better way to like. I like bunked all these beds. Interesting. Okay, I'm gonna search this. No, I don't want to sleep. Stop. F. I want to search. Oh, can I not take that? I guess not. Okay, well, looks like we have, I think, got everything out of here. Yes, sir. I guess I should always be check this. Search cabinet, see if we got anything in here. Nope. All right, let's go. Can we go up? Anything up here? Oh, hey, we, we got a like a possible gun. Hey, we got a sh pump shotgun. Cool. Pump action shotgun. Things in bad shape, but it's all rusted up. Looks like we are done looting this place. There you are, Bell. Right, let's head out. How much money do we make from that? Oh. <laughs> Actually, not too bad. Okay, cool. That was a cool little side mission right that we had going on right there. Wow, that's a view. Dad gone. That's beautiful. Screenshot. I like taking these screenshots. Cool. All right, what we got? Oh dang. We were a lot further from camp than I expected. What we got here? Okay. Looks like side missions are starting to open up a little bit. Oh, uh, what are we at? 19 minutes? I guess we could head over here and do this side mission. Might as well. See if we run into anything along the way. Might as well do these side missions while we can, right? That's a little... It's not the most exciting part of the game, but you know, you gotta enjoy You gotta take your time. You don't wanna rush these things gotta take in the atmosphere and the nostalgia anything over there good yeah you never know hell you're so fast All right. what we got let's nope I don't want to rest Loot. Let's loot it before this guy gets back. 
Witness. Uh oh. Uh oh. Yep. Lee. I hope they didn't recognize me. They probably did, unfortunately. Okay, we're good. They didn't catch us. Whoa! Die gone. Uh, let's go, Impala. So, what do you guys, uh, is there anything with this game that, uh, I should know about? Which, I know this video will come out just the way it's gonna be, it's gonna come out a lot from a while from now but you know I I'll come back through and read the comments so is there anything you guys uh, think I should know about the game or anything I'm missing that it's like I should check out let me know I will see if I can take a look but uh, yeah we should be getting close I think such a beautiful game though guys like and like I've said before I'm not playing it on ultra I'm playing it I think on high just cuz it's uh, I don't get nearly as good of frames in certain areas on ultra as I do on high um, but it's still like that on this game's beautiful like I feel even like on low this game will still look really good Squirrel. Bird. West Elizabeth. We have twenty. We have two bounties. One in Valentine for twenty-two dollars, and then that one for twenty. Yeah. West of Elizabeth. All right, let's go, Impala. Still got the cow, uh, the fox skin on the back. I probably should just spend time like off off camera hunting uh, to upgrade my satchel and stuff. Whoa. What do we got going on here? Driscoll. Let's loot the bodies. These are our Driscolls, right? Yeah. Oh, I'm gonna loot them all. Well, I get negative honor for looting this guy, probably. He's dead, so we're good. Yeah. Okay, let's see what we got. Loot this body up here, too. Darn our Driscolls. <laughs> I took them all out with the 22. All right. Come on now, boy. All right, let's let's uh, yeah. get out of there. Before somebody comes looking for us. All right, let's go do this side quest up here with the photographer.
see what he's got for us this time. Last time he took a picture of us, and then Coyote took a, his bag, if I remember right. Where is he at? Up here somewhere. Where you at, buddy? There you are. What is he looking at? Who is that? Hello again. Hello. Scaredy. Oh, hello. How are you, sir? Uh, Morgan, Mr. Morgan. Oh, I'm sorry, my my nerves. I'm not quite the outdoor adventurer I thought. This is God's own country, and I feel I'm in purgatory. I know the feeling. No, I hope not. What you trying to take some pictures of, huh? Some more greedy coyotes? No. Wolves. Wolves? Well, you really are trying to get <laughs> yourself eaten. Oh, I hope not. I left the meat over there. I thought I'd be safe. Given the wind. Yeah, sure. You managed to attract the world's least intelligent wolf. Well, I... I... Well, I'll stay with you a while. If anything comes, I'll protect you as needed. You are a gentleman. Now, you don't know me very well. And to me, you're a gentleman. Usually, uh, get that I'm worse than the, the shotgun. You had many dealings with wolves, Mr. Morgan? Sure. But you've never been eaten. Not through lack of trying on their part. A while back, I helped a oh. friend from getting devoured. Usually, they are not great fans of man. Don't blame them. Me neither. Here they come. Hey, shh. There's one. Looks like we got company. Yes, yes, there they are. In the trees. Now, don't do anything. I'm going to take a few photographs. Come on. Oh, Come boy. Come on. Oh, we're in trouble now. They're gonna come from everywhere. Stay back, stay back. Can't have a man in frame. They think it's staged. Yeah, sort of is. Look at them. Magnificent creatures. Especially when clawing at your eyeballs. Come on. Stay still, my beauties. <laughs> Study him. Come here. Hey, is that all of them? We might have kept the wolves from the door. Woo! Come on. Snap out of it. You're safe. <laughs> my whole futile existence <laughs> before my eyes. Yeah, they can good thing. Be I'm a good aggressive. shot. Just saying, you know. What a waste. Literally a dog's dinner. Still worse things happen at sea. Do they? <laughs> Well, I imagine. Perhaps wolves do better at sea. Are they good swimmers? Well, who knows? You have saved my poor foolish skin once again. Don't mention it. Well, I can't begin to repay my debt of gratitude. But no, I am eternally in your debt. I do, Mr. Mason, I do. You take care now. And you huh. too, sir. We got a lot of skins here. Hold on. They may not be worth much, but you know, it's a skin. Take all these wolf pelts. Ooh, a lot of pelts. I thought that would take longer. Where were you at, Impala? Uh, oh wait, that's not Impala. There's Impala. Ah, Impala, you got scared. You really went really far. Where, where you at? Get up here. Mom, we got wolf pelts to gather. I'll be some time working on the mechanism. Good day to you, sir. 
Take all these pelts. Gray wolf belt. The only trophy I need is a photograph, and I hope it catches on. Don't worry about me. Lightning doesn't strike in the same place, and neither do wolves. <laughs> <laughs> this guy's gonna get himself eaten, like Arthur said. Got several pelts here. I think they're probably damaged because I used a shotgun, but you know, still a little bit of money. It's not a lot, but you know, every little bit counts. Right, boy. Hold on. Thank you again. Very well. How many pelts can we hold at one time? We got one more over here. Alright, get this one. And we will be done with this episode, I think, guys. Because we are on 32 minutes, so not too bad. You know, a little bit of excitement. Nothing crazy, but you know, robbed a house, killed some wolves. Typical day in the wild, wild west, if I do say so myself. Wow, my eyes just started watering. I promise I'm not crying. All right. Well, guys, we're going to end this episode here. So I hope you guys did enjoy. And if you did, please, 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 please. Please hit that like button. Like, just click. That's okay. You just click. You know, you hover over it and click. But, and then if you didn't like or if you don't like me, it's okay. I understand. You know, I can't please everybody, but you could hit that dislike button. I like to hear your feedback, you know. So, it's like, yeah. It's okay. I understand. You know, it's not gonna. It's not gonna hurt me too bad. You know, it'll. 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 It'll sting for a little bit. A little, little bit of a, a sweat bee sting, but it's okay. I can. I can take it. <laughs> but if you guys want more of this content, hit that subscribe button. Stay tuned for the next episode of the Red Dead Redemption Two playthrough. And you guys know what to do. Do good. Do have fun. And make sure you help somebody out. I think that's right. I need to really write this down and just like put it here so I make sure I say it right every time. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you next time. Peace.